Hello Nitin sir. My question is how to use the same flute in a different scale. For example, this is an E bass flute. So in an E bass flute, sa, ri, ga, ma, pa, da, ni, sa. If I want to play the same flute in a F, F hash scale, then it becomes sa, ri, ga, ma, pa, da, ni, sa. So this is like the comal ri becomes ni. So how to understand the relationship between the E scale and the F hash scale and how to play it in the same flute. So how to... Namaskar. I think his question is basically about what happens when we change the Sa on an instrument. In case of a flute, changing the Sa means we use some other swar as the sa and then play it from there. So for example, now this is a this is an E flute, which means the sa is tuned to E. So this the Tantura is playing the E. And then these are my Saregama. This is the normal Shuddha Saptak with the Shuddha Madhyam. This is the Shuddha Madhyam, Pa, and the Sa. Now the first part of the question is, what happens when I make, which is my Ray, I make it is Sa. So my Re becomes the Sa. So which means I have to change the Tanpura to another key which is So this is now the Sa but this was the Re in the earlier E scale. Now with this as the Sa, if I have to, if I just play the original positions, this obviously is not the Shuddha Sapta. I am not getting the Shuddha Gandhar and the Shuddha Nishad. Instead, I get the Komal Ga and the Komal Ni. So if I have to play the Shuddha Saptak, then I have to play different notes. Different notes meaning different positions on the instrument. So, instead of this now, this becomes my Ga. Similarly, this would be the Komal Ni, to make the Shuddha Ni, I have to play. This becomes my Sare Gama Pata. The important question is, uh, why do we need to do this at all? Let's see an example of say, Rag Malkaus. If I have to play Malkaus, I am back to my E Tantura. This is Malkaus. Malkaus, Malkaus uses the Komal Gandhar, Shuddha Madhyam, Komal Daivat, Komal Nishad. And I have generally seen that there is a sort of a perceived fear of uh, Komal notes. 
on the on the bansuri because you have to produce them by half closing the holes so generally the tendency is to avoid komal swar so what can be done to play the malkons is i change the sa so that i avoid the komal notes so if i change the sa to something else so now this is my sa which is actually the dha on my foot with this as the sa i can play the malkons with da as the sa and instead of having to play the komal ga and komal ni i am actually playing the my sa becomes the komal ga the re becomes the ma the ma becomes the komal dha komal ni and Malkons becomes very easy on the flute. We can take another example. I have to play Bhairavi. So again, all the komals para. Komal swara. What I can do is instead of changing the sa, I change the flute. I choose a flute for which its nishad, its ni is my sa, and then Bhairavi becomes very easy. and is i don't have to play any komal swara at all i just play the full holes and i get the bhairavi so bhairavi becomes easy to play the next and the most important question is should we be doing this is there a problem in doing this let us see what exactly is happening here this is my sa this is the re and this is the ga i am assuming that by changing the sa from the sa to the re original ga becomes the re of that re and so on there is a slight problem with this the problem is the distance between the sa and the re and the distance between the re and the ga is not the same in terms of the frequencies in terms of the ratios If I make the re as the sa and assume the ga to be the re, there is a slight variation in the ratio. The variation is about two percent in this case, and it will keep changing 
depending upon what star you choose and depending upon what note you are playing so what actually is happening is if i play this are ga ma pada ni sa from the re to make it sound right i have to keep making small adjustments at various parts that can happen only if if uh, you are ve- your your ear is very good your musical ear is very good you are completely in tune otherwise it doesn't really sound very good so this sort of a change in the flute or changing the sa could work well or okay if you are accompanying a song where you just have to play pieces in between connecting pieces in between at a very fast pace but if you have to play a rag with this adjustment then particularly in the alap you will find it very tough and then you will probably come to a conclusion that it is it is actually better to put all that effort in working on my komal notes so to conclude i'll just say that it is it is much better to shed the fear of komal notes work on your komal notes work on the half closed holes and uh, play everything using the one single flute